Got another video with you guys today. As you guys seen before that my turbos were shot. Today I'm filming the video because I recently just shopped with Max. If you guys don't know about Max Speeding, they make uh, very great coilovers, but they just recently went into building turbos. Well, they've been building turbos since they come out of here, but this thing has a six, six by six billet wheel instead of the stock instead of the stock uh, OEM spec. My car currently has uh, car currently is at let's see seventy nine thousand miles. So if you guys have approximately over 70,000 miles I would say change your turbos <laughs> catch can out it's gonna get loud this damn uh, train as you guys can see this thing passes by pretty frequently but yeah uh, these things I've been doing some research on them and I I haven't found any bad research on them, you know. Seen a couple YouTubers uh, make five to six hundred horsepower on these easily, and I'm not looking to push nothing too crazy with my bill right now, given that I'm still in the works of putting it together. Uh, it's pretty nice off here. I am looking to go with the carbon fiber hood. The guy didn't pretty really paint the car too great. I did give her a wash down before the video. The car came in this condition. I noticed that the right side of the suspension is sitting pretty lower, a lot lower than the left side. And I would say that because look at how beaten these tires are. It's just going right up on the wheel well and killing the paint. See how it's starting to surface rust in. I don't think the guy had the car in too great of a condition, but that's what I'm here for, to bring it right back together. And if you guys have not heard, I am raffling this car off. Buy a t-shirt, buy a hoodie, and that will be your entry into winning this Dream BMW 335 convertible spec. Up underneath the hood of this thing. Like I was talking about earlier, I did pull my catch can out the other day, and I think I got it wired up the wrong fucking way. I don't want to say I do, but hey, we all make mistakes, right? <laughs> but basically, uh, pull this thing. I just unscrew this thing out. Not even getting blow bomb, but. Comment below if I'm running this thing correctly. Is it supposed to be X'd out like this or should they be straight now? I don't know. My father thinks I'm a kooky ass motherfucker for running it like that. But that is how I seen it. So I'm running Burger Motorsports. And it takes neat new ones. You see how? Yeah. I uh, recently just got my heat work back working. I pulled this hose out back there. You see that? Pulled it out. Put an air uh, sprayer down there. I'm gonna probably drop a video on how to do that because I know a lot of you guys are probably having just no heat issues in the car, just always running cold. And this thing helped me out a lot. But I did that and my heat started working for the first time I had the car in three years. Uh, new red alternator. Just just swap that thing out. Uh, blow up valve needs to be changed out because. I don't like this. I want better. As you guys can see, I have been just driving with my oil cap open. And I know you guys are out there like, this guy's not a BMW owner. This guy doesn't this guy shouldn't own this car. You are co fucking wreck. But I like the I want better. But I'm gonna sit here and trial and tribulation this until I get the spec I want. 
So till next chat. I will be uh, showing you guys in my next video how to install tour balls and a new catch can because I don't think I wired that up right, man. Comment below what you guys think. Buy the merch, buy the tees, get your entry into winning this car right now. And if you guys have not heard, I am raffling this car off. Buy a t-shirt, buy a hoodie, and that will be your entry into winning this Dream BMW 335 convertible spec. And as you guys continue to follow my channel, you can follow me while I fix little nitty gritty things like this. And also nitty gritty things like this. And as I'll add a lot of oohs and ahs to the back end. I'm uh, installing a M3 rear bumper with the M3 exhaust after I do the turbos. That's been my whole plan since I got the car, so I'm gonna stick to it so that the next owner can be a happy camper. But thank you guys for watching today. I will be heading home because I shouldn't even be outside with this thing. Uh, and I promised my niece some hot Cheetos. So thanks, chat. See you guys with another video probably within the next two or three days but yeah thank you guys for watching and please subscribe like and comment if you guys like see anything interesting out there you want me to do to my bmw like i seen that they had this uh ashtray delete where you can add a, a portable phone charger so things like that would be cool to show you guys how i did it so just comment what you guys think I should do and uh, enjoy the video.